everyone. Hello, uh, dear viewers in France. Uh, today I would like to tell you about subject that I really, um, I really want to tell you about this for a very long time, and I thought about it. Um, about the 50 cents army, you see. So uh, in China, um, uh, there are some people who are paid, uh, young people who are paid uh, to uh, interact in the social media and uh, what they will do is they will post some comments on the social media and pretend to be uh, someone who they are not. So they will create fake profile and they will disguise and then they will post uh, hateful comments. And um, now um, I have many, many, many of these guys on my channel and uh, I get many comments, many such comments. So now I have no proof because you don't have any proof um, of this. Uh, people know that they exist. I've read some articles saying that I think there are about eight, eight or 18 million people working uh, and doing this. So their job is this full time and they get paid by the, by the comments. So they, they are called... Uh, they're called 50 cents because apparently for one comment that they post, they get five mao. Not sure if it's true, but uh, I'm, what I'm sure is, I, I, yes, I believe there are at least eight million, eight million of these guys in China. And they do this. Let's go inside the dining hall so there is uh, more light. And um, at first I was thinking, okay, I'm going to make a list of all these guys on my channel who uh, post uh, hateful comments. And uh, I believe they are uh, working as 50 cents and I will show you their comment. But then I thought, uh, just let it be, uh, because I have no proof. And I am um, someone, I don't like to accuse anyone. I don't like to accuse anyone without proof. I think um, as long as uh, someone is, n as long as there is no proof, you cannot say, uh, you cannot accuse anyone. You cannot say anyone did anything. As long as there is no proof, you cannot say anything. You know? But um, you need to be warned about this. You need to be very wary about this. I think um, there is really too much hate in this world and too much hate going on. And it all starts with words. And especially uh, it all starts with the medias. The hate will start on the media. It will start on the internet. And this will push the people against each other. And all these guys who are working as 50 cents um, they are very bad. What they are doing is very bad for the world. It's very bad for me. It's very bad for you because they push each other to hate each other. They push the hate, and that's how they keep they keep uh, they keep things going on. You have many people in China, in France, uh, in the U.S. who are unhappy with their life. Um, I was unhappy with my life for a very long time. There are many people who have hard life, and um, because people have hard life. Uh, people start to think and to say why, why it is like this, why uh, don't I, why I don't have a job, or why I don't get paid uh, very well, or why I have to work so many hours, or why, and they start to criticize the government because they find out the system is not good. And I'm not talking about China, I'm talking about so many countries, it's even worse in, Afri in some African countries, it's some places better, some places worse, it also depends on your job, it depends on your situation, maybe as a foreigner in, as a foreigner in China, you are lucky, you get uh, uh, more chance, but uh, of course the migrant worker or the guy who is just uh, uh, maybe graduated or this, everybody is different and uh, for some people it's very hard, you know. And I think it is important that people start to think by themselves and see, okay, my life, I don't feel good in my life. Why? What could be done? What could be improved? I need to improve myself because I can change myself. But also the government needs to do more for this or the government should change this or should change that. Uh, maybe there should be less pollution. Maybe there should be higher salaries. Maybe there should be less gap between rich and poor. Maybe there should be uh, uh, more peace in this part of the world. Maybe there shouldn't be overpopulation. Maybe uh, we should uh, control the, the freedom of uh, this and that. You need to take decision. You know, and I think um, in order to take the right decision, you need to hear the people. You need to hear what they have to say, and the people who are suffering, what they have to say. You know, and then you can decide. And all these guy, um, these fifty cents, this guy working and writing fake comments. What they do is on their comments, they either praise the Chinese government, they praise China, they praise the Communist Party, either they push the hate. So they will say, uh, how do they push the hate? So I will give you some typical comments that they have and that I have on my channel all the time. I say. Um, 
Foreigners get all the girls. White male in China always uh, fuck so many Chinese girls. So they push the hate like this. And I, I get so many comments like this. And I, I know for sure it cannot be normal people who say this. It's no one w will. I mean, some teenagers will speak this way. But I know you will never post this kind of comment. This kind of comment, hateful comments, they are just there to make people hate each other. Look at the foreigners, they get all the girls. This is the, this is the people who write this, of course, uh, they are the 50 cents. This is, cannot be. Either they are 50 cents, either they are people from uh, who are teenagers, you see. So I get many comments like this on my channel. So uh, anyway, the foreigners are so lucky. Or this can be this kind of from the foreigners are so lucky. Or the foreigners destroyed China. You know, you have many comments like this also. Or um, the Communist Party saved China. So you have many comments about the Communist Party praising the government, praising the Communist Party. You have many comments about uh, how foreigners are so nasty with Chinese people, how we destroy China, how we, uh, we take all the girls, how we get paid so much and uh, we don't deserve this kind of income you know all these comments that they, they are not real they are not real you know and I know this that they are not real but people who are random people who read this comment and read this comment and and what they want you you know what these guys these 50 cents army what they want you they want to make you angry then you will answer them and you will start insulting them and that's what they want then you have normal people normal Chinese people normal foreigners who will see this and they will get angry and because they get angry what they will do is say I am Chinese and they will love their, their governments and they will love and they will follow the 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 government no matter what you know and this is uh, how it is and they will not criticize anything they will say yes that's how it is I should not criticize look how the foreigners treat us you know that's how it is and they will do this and this and this and when you have millions of comments hundreds of millions of comments who say this then people read it then that's how you control people mind you know and that's that, that's the kind of propaganda that they do here so I'm a little bit tired about this and I, I checked several profiles of this guy and I noticed, uh, you know, how do I check this guy? How do, how do I find out? First, the comments. So as I told you, the comment to praise the, the government, the comment who are against the foreigner, always against the foreigner. Then I checked, did he post one comment on my channel or did he post two, three, four, five, six, ten? Sometimes these guys, usually they will not post one comment. They will, they will post on all your videos or they will post on five, six, seven, eight videos. And also what I checked is I checked the, 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 the profile, check the photo. You know, on YouTube, you need to put a photo. So these guys, they put a photo. You can see it's a fake photo. There are many fake profiles. They are not even Chinese. Some of them, they don't put the Chinese names. They just pretend they are foreigners. So they have also some other comments like, the, fuck Chinese people, fuck the chink, fuck the yellow. You have this kind of comment. I know for sure. Most of these comments, maybe you have some, some teenagers who post this, but many of these comments, they are also not real. They are also b from the 50 cents army. So these are fake profile that I think were created. I have no proof, but that's what I think. They were created and they pushed the hate, you know, on both sides. They pushed the hate on both sides. And when it's end up in the war and when people die, this guy will be responsible. So I had to speak up and to say this, you know, because uh, one day, you know, you do this, you do this, you do this. And then when it explodes, you are responsible, you know. And um, shame on them, you know, shame on them, shame on you if you are listening to me, you know. <coughs> because what I want to do with my videos is push the peace, push the understanding. I'm here, I want to understand the culture, I'm here, I want to understand the things that, that I like, the things that I don't like, we discuss. And uh, that's how it is. Sometimes I criticize, sometimes I say the good things, but I don't push the hate. That's not what I want, you know. I, I want people to understand each other. Uh, I hate no one. I love uh, my life. And even though I complain sometimes, uh, I'm never... I'm never nasty, I'm never angry at anyone and even people who don't, don't share my view or maybe don't understand my uh, view or my way of life, I don't blame them, it's just how it is, we are different and uh, in life you need understanding, but not this. And also, yes, I, I tell you, you need to check the f their, their profile photo. Kind of, they always will still, they will not put their photos, they will take the photos from the internet. And also what I checked sometimes is, I check their YouTube channel and I see, uh, did they post any videos and what kind of videos they post online? From the videos you will know. Sometimes you will know it's a fake profile. 
uh, from the videos that they post and what you can check also is uh, uh, did they subscribe to other channels so I have with some of these guys I see oh it's funny they subscribe to Serpenzeas and to my channel and then um, to some uh, political channel and something like this and you know there 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 are always ways to fool you how to make the profile that will look real you know how to create a profile that will look real that's that's what you need to think uh, it's all about analyze you know um, uh, maybe one day I will just take some of his profile and and look at it with you and you will see you know. so I hope um, uh, peace for everyone you know I hope you understand uh, this uh, video and I will talk to you next time thank you again again for your support subscribe to the channel share my videos because all these videos are um, what helps us to live together in the small world you know and not uh, push our govern government versus government people versus people and in the end war and hate this is not what we want uh, so I love you everyone take care see you soon